Thank you so much for joining me as Game Edge. I'm super excited to jump in and test out the release of Survival Fountain of Youth. It's coming on early access of well, April 19th. So yeah, if you haven't put your wish list, I'll put a link in the description down below. And again, if you're excited seeing this on a channel or any new games and such, hit the like button, subscribe, all the wonderful stuff. And of course, don't forget to put your wish list. Yeah, it helps out indie devs a lot to promote their games. I really, I always do it. I smack it up when I like something and this one looked really good. Now we play the prologue, we played the demo. It was a very challenging. I think there's been some balancing done to this, and it's been quite extensive work put into this since the last time we visited. I think it was last summer. Uh, this is, of course, in the 16th century in the Caribbean islands where we actually well have to survive and get off of it and learn the secrets of the Fountain of Youth. And yeah, I'm, I'm really I'm stoked. Anyways, if you guys are enjoying us, you know what to do, all that wonderful stuff. Let's do this. This story is inspired by real events. According to historic records, on March 4th, 1513, three ships sailed from Puerto Rico. They were heading to faraway islands and were led by the famous explorer Juan Ponce de Leon. The goal of the expedition was to search for the legendary Fountain of Youth. It all began in Puerto Rico, when Governor Juan Ponce de Leon gave military support to the chief Gaibana in a war against other tribes. The Spanish soldiers quickly ended the war and restored peace. The grateful chief told Ponce de Leon an ancient legend of his people, a legend about Bimini, a hidden island lost in the sea. According to the legend, in the center of Bimini is the Fountain of Youth. Anyone who drinks from it will enjoy long years of health and youth. The chief also gave him an old map, covered with inscriptions in an ancient language. The map showed an uncharted group of islands. The location to search was clear, but the inscriptions were still a mystery to uncover. The captain believed in the legend and began to prepare an expedition. The best scientists and sailors of the new and old worlds volunteered to join his adventure. A total of three ships sailed off, the Santiago, the Santa Maria, and the San Cristobal. Ponce de Leon was sure that the ancient map would lead them to the fountain and bring them fame, wealth, and eternal youth. The voyage to the islands took an entire month. On the 30th day of the journey, the lookout spotted islands up ahead. They were the islands from the map. The expedition was just one day from its goal. All right, looks like we're up. Master, master, wake up, please. Get ready for morning assembly. All right. You're storing. I don't know how I slept with you snoring next to me. <laughs> All right, let's go and check this out here now. Prepare for the uh, council. That's very important. And uh, we have to get ourselves ready for that last will and testament in case of that can hand uh, from old age. Ba -ba -ba. All right, so this is the signing of properties and stuff. Uh, yeah, it's, it's all good. We're, we're not looking to die. We're not looking to die at all. I remember this a little bit. We did do this last time. This doesn't look any... Well, this part doesn't look any different. We have to go upstairs. To the bow of the ship. Bow wow. Oh. What the freak? That wasn't here before. How did he get out? Did he call these dogs? Oh my god. He got out. Oh, he got out of his cage. So I guess we're transporting some of these. Uh. We're all cool. We're all. Oh god. I used a block. Pressing right mouse button, okay, before the enemy attacks. Aha, like that! So, right before. Gotcha, you, you little bump. Oh, oh, I got a sword now. Okay, uh, okay, block attacks by blocking hits. Use a charge power. Okay, I know that one. Hold down. Pow! Sucker! Didn't get me once, except for my freaking arm a little bit there, but you psycho. <laughs> All right, take the map. There it is. We got said map. What? What, you want some of this? You want some? No, I didn't think so. Didn't think so. 
All right, we're going to go back into the captain's cabin, which is right up here. Where is a freaking captain? Am I the captain? I don't understand. I was sleeping down below. Usually the cab doesn't have his own place to sleep and stuff. I guess so, but... Oh, that's the stuff. By the way, this is the actual liquid for the fountain. If you supposed to, you can take this. And, uh, yeah, ancient artifact right here. And now that we explore, we found mysterious traces of native cultures. I suppose, okay, this is the actual, yeah, fountain of youth and stuff that's on top there. I guess maybe he got himself a little rock. Maybe a tablet's part. I don't know. They want us to grab the uh, flint and stuff. There it is. Okay. And, yep, yeah, we have to light this baby up. Stunning. Oh, boy. Can I open this up and grab those? Nothing else around here. I know I have to go up there in Expedition Logbook, but I was checking around the area, make sure we're not missing anything else here. Looks like several cut maps. I'm staying on table. There we go. So you guys want to read this part. Pause it up. I'll roll it down for y'all. Uh, we went through this last time. Quite extensive. And what they've been through to get to this point. I think it took about a month to get here. All right, I guess we're going to have to get ourselves ready for all hell break loose. And here it comes. Rogue waves. Oh, boy. Whoa! Remember when that first time, I think the first time I ever seen something hit us really hard was in Stranded Deep. And then Subnautica also did that too. People always think of Subnautica. I think Strand Deep was the first one that actually did that. People were mentioning that to me beforehand on other stories. But yeah, they got hit in the head. Boom, knocked out. Love it. Uh, but all right, let's go and do this. They don't have it anymore in Strand Deep, though. It used to be the cart, the little cart they used there. We just go and get ourselves a martini when we first started and they changed it up. All right, we're going to grab the map. This is the grotto location. We're going to go there right away. Last time I stayed on the beach, it was miserable. The rain killed me almost. Uh, initially, so we can build ourselves, a, of course, craft ourselves a bunch of stuff. Plus, we can also make ourselves our own shelters and stuff, and our own base. So I'm super excited to test it out. Tons of islands to go and visit too, which I've never done. So that's really cool. All right, that's where we want to go. Okay, now we have to go in the chest and select stuff we might want to bring with us. Uh, this is not even a doubt. I'm gonna grab this. Okay, this will allow me to carry more items. I don't care. This is super important. Oh. Protect me from bad weather and animal attacks. This would be really nice. Uh, again, there's durability on these things, so you realize some of these are really low. Iron flint. This would be nice to start a fire. Nice and simple. Fire starter helps me ignite fire and craft survival items. Huh. Interesting. Uh, improved fishing rod. Okay, this was something we may craft later on. These ones are really nice as spears, but look how degraded this one is. Enemies and islands to hunt. And also the axe right away for cutting down trees and weapons. Protect. I know we can craft our own. Rocks are hard to find on this island, but... Uh, plants. This might actually be good. Harvest from plants. This might be good for us to have. There's also food and uh, pistol ammo, which we don't have ammo or anything for that, so... Or at least a, sorry, an actual gun to bring with us. And medicine. I'm going to grab this one for once. Usually the axe would be the first thing I'd bring. I think the iron knife might be handy to have. Ooh. They're both useful. Why can't I just grab both? Got a backpack. Harvest plants and also weapons to protect them. Kind down trees and also use a weapon to protect. Ooh. I think I'm going to do it this time. This We're going to make our own axe afterwards. All right. We're good. So now we got to jump through the window. I think you can change your decision if you want to. Uh, yep, you can, so that's nice. And here we go, we're, we're gonna jump through this. Go for it! The storm came out of nowhere. None of us were ready for it. Strong winds and giant waves blew up in a split second and crashed into the ship. The sails were torn apart and the ship slammed into the reefs. The sailors jumped from their bunks and tried to save the ship, but it was too late. I came to my senses on the sandy shore. My memories were gone. 
I could not even remember my name. But I was alive, and hoped that at least one of my fellow crew members had also escaped. Alright, here we go. Up and at him's... Now, top left, remember that little sun thing? We gotta be careful for that. And I think C for afflictions, we can check this oh. out, right? Yeah, you see, near death and nearby, so we actually take the medicine if we want to. And this is a little part there that you actually get recovered with this. Plus, I believe it gives you health and stuff, so I'm not sure if we can do that right away. Uh, burning sun, so we gotta be careful to stay out of the sun if we're gonna craft and do other things. We need to pick up a coconut. It's so weird to have the sword. Usually I pick up the axe, I think, if I'm mistaken, or the spear, either or. We'll grab this stuff since we're walking towards there. I'm gonna go. And what do you want us to do? Craft the coconut. What I wanna do is in shade as much as I possibly can. So we're gonna duck ourselves in here. You see a top left, the shade is, well, the shade's helping out quite a bit. We're gonna do this here. Tons of crafting, and as we progress, there's all this stuff here. It's going to start opening up and it'll tell you what's new here. We have a stone cutter here. Uh, this one right over here, we have ourselves a leaf cape. Which if we pick up five of these, we can make a leaf cape. Very nice. We can also make a primitive torch. We got some sticks. We have ourselves a primitive bed, which needs five. There's also better beds will come in afterwards. And there's a canopy we can craft up. I'm guaranteed you to go to the grotto. It's something I didn't do last time. I tried to tough it out in the beach. But I think we're going to start off in a grotto. Man, there's a lot of stuff here. Okay, so I just want to clear that out so we know what we're doing. Uh, there's also a journal here for quenching thirst, which you're going to go through. Also notes and stuff. That, uh, again, this is what we read beforehand in a grotto map. And over here we have, okay, the tales and the chronicles and stuff. We don't even know her name, which is, uh, I guess, yeah, interesting. I don't remember that being a part of it, but it probably was. And over here we have, what, survival abilities. Oh, nice. Survival tasks, native... Chronicles, which we get uh, ooh, XP for that. Same thing for this. Some kind of point here. I don't know what that is for. Oh, wow. 80 XP for crafting. Reduces crafting duration by... Oh, boy. This is nice. I don't think this was here last time, was it? I don't even know. Cost one. This is where we can actually upgrade ourselves. Concentration and stuff. Very nice. We have that V for concentration already. I don't think we have that yet. All right, cool. Uh, so we have to craft our stuff up. Let's get rolling because the time is not on our side. We want to get as much done as possible. We're going to want to eat that. I'm pretty sure, right? Yeah, drink the coconut water and take it down. It'll help us out right here. That was actually pretty darn decent. All right, uh, fine shells. I saw one right here. Oh, it's actually pointed oh. right there too. I want to go that far in the sun, dude. If I'm crafting, I think it's going to be in the shade. Learned my lesson the first time I play this game. Been a hot minute since the last time I played it. Watch out for injury chances too. Can happen. And I guess we can choose uh, different things here on the bottom, but let's do this here. The amount. Usually you can like, select different kind of tools and stuff, but this one you're not needed. We need to get a stone cutter though, I think. All right, the journal is now satisfying hunger, so we're going to do this. We got this little sucker out. Again, you have a chance of indigestion. Please don't happen. We have eight food and four water for this. All right, a place to sleep. Okay, so they're going to point us to these trees here. Again, stay in the shade. And we can do F to select all these. Might as well grab them, harvest them up. It takes 30 minutes. It also tells you how much weight you're going to be carrying. All right, we got that. The next thing for us to do is maybe... Is this a day tree or no? Eh? No. Let's go out over here. We'll try to pick up some stuff off the beach here. I do need to find the, the better... These are more coconuts and stuff. I think we'll hold off just a tiny bit. We'll come back. How long will this take? 25 minutes. I think it's going to grab a few more. Because we're going to go a little bit further out. I don't see any sticks or anything. All right, got to be careful now. Top left. We have that problem. This little sucker... Oh, I got him. Supper served, baby. Very nice. I know you can throw our items too at these things. There's some crates all over the place, by the way. If you're wondering, if you want to take away the sun, just go to here. For a few seconds, grab this. You can go into the water too. I know there's crates. I think there's breads and apples and stuff we can pick up. We did it last time. We're going to go ahead out to the grotto first. 
I've never been able to harpoon the fishes and stuff, but we'll we'll try our best to see what we can do. I see some sticks there. One second. Is this not good enough? There we go. Okay. Those things here gives us a special leaves we can make clothing with. So if not mistaken, this would be a best thing for us to do. Select all. Do it. How are we doing on the sun? Oops, top left. <laughs> Does this thing grow back, though? You generate over time. It requires at least a few weeks. Okay. That's not bad. All right, I think that's all we're going to do. And I hear... Uh, all right, he's pretty far away. He's near the chamomile, if not mistaken. This is not good enough for shade, I right hear. No, it's not good enough for shade. I would hear. This should be good. All right, give himself a few seconds. I think we can press C. Is it? Yeah, it's not really doing very much, eh? It's not going down. All right, we're getting close to that problem. So let's just grab what we can from here, shells and stuff. And head out towards the grotto there. So find food here. All right, I'm not going to chase you because I, I don't want to go towards that dog. Yeah, we're going to get some issues very, very shortly. I need to get to the shoreline. Uh, sorry, to the uh, cliffside here. I really... I'm going to hit it. Damn it. I'm going to get sunburned right on the first day. There was different degrees of sunburn, too. And we can make ourselves some... Clothing. I'm not sure if they'll let me craft this up as we're going through this. Maybe a little cape action. Melee Firestar clothing, their equipment. Let's just craft it up. That'll help us out a little bit. Leave cape. I don't know if I should waste all that just yet. I'm still getting hit by the sun. Oh my god. That was stupid to do that in the sun. I thought we were covered by the uh, direction of that, but no. Oh, don't get sunburned. You're going to get sunburned. Yeah, I knew it. All right, so we have effects here. This is weather effects. Okay, effects exposed to be bad weather. A long time, uh, you can get sick. We want to avoid that. We're going to go in cave anyway, so. We've got sunburn level one. It's hopefully it'll go away. Grab all this. All right, it stayed in shade. That's good. It should go away. There's some other things on the beach front right now. What's the sun at? Okay. Let's grab a few more of these here. Cool. How are we doing, son? We're doing okay. Right, I'm going to pick up this rock because I know we're going to need it. We can craft those into smaller rocks. Grab a couple of these things here. There's a tablet right here, by the way. And it's ancient hunting. If we crouch, so it mentions. I remember that one. Not a ton of sticks on the beach, though. Thought I'd see a few more. I think we can take apart these for sticks. All right, let's get inside really quick. Oh, yeah, we have to be careful. Scorpions in here. There they are. No mistake, I think I could throw this. And kill those little buggers. And also, if you light that fire... We did it once, and they just ran away. But, yeah, not really in the mood. All right, let's just do this really quick. We're going to craft up. We need to craft up first. A whole bunch of stuff here. We got the other coconuts. We can make ourselves some food and stuff, too. On the back end, we are kind of hungry. But they're going to want us to make this first. Oh, mapping charcoal. Now we need to go in the cartographer tree. Remember that one? Yeah, we're making some sandals. Some fencing. Wow, nice. Box made branches. Also, I no mistake, we could carry one with us. Campfire. Where we have one here for free. And the stone here, we can craft up this. Really nice, by the way. We can make ourselves four stones. But first things first. Uh, let's make ourselves a bed. I'm going to put it right here. And I want to make a better bed than this. And we'll place resources. I don't think the scorpions come back, by the way. 
Okay, so sleep for six hours. All right, there is sticks here, which is great. I didn't realize that. Some more of this stuff. Ooh, nice. We can craft up some stuff. Uh, this helps us start a fire. Cut. I don't think I have anything cut. I'm going to need to get... Yeah. Don't get the axe, game edge. Fine, I was joking. Probably could have taken the axe to make more sense. This is what's spoiled or something? Or no, it's green. Ripe. Pile of scrap. Am I overweight now? Oh, damn. Uh, drop. Hold the drop all. Okay, that's nice. I like that. Why am I so overweight? The amount of palms I have on me, I think, eh? These things are bloody heavy. Yeah, I should have really picked it all up. Okay, so they want me to sleep for six hours. There's a letter right here. Our captain, Juan Ponce de Leon, also survived the shipwreck. Sea currents brought him to this same island just a bit earlier before my awakening. He located the grotto and made it his temporary shelter. Then he started to act quickly and decisively. After building up the temporary camp, the captain began to explore the island. He named it the Island of Hope. During another trip, he heard distant cannon shots. It was a signal from one of our ships. The captain left this note, then hurriedly packed up and sailed toward the sound of the cannon fire. He was in a rush to help his crew. Running quickly, he forgot his spyglass on the other side of the island. If I find it, I will be able to look around the island. Well, that's good to know. We'll go and take care of that. If you guys want to pause the spyglass, I think it's the same exact thing he was mentioning. Is it dark outside? No. Dark in here, though. All right. And this is a f liquid living water. We're going to leave that there. No, about living water. Okay. Leaving a bottle of living water so that a person who finds... Restore their health in a shipwreck. Good luck. Right now, we're going to try to avoid it as much as possible until we need it, because I remember we get quite a bit back from it. Uh, island. Oh, nice. On his map, Cape Ponce Leone marked approximate locations of two water sources. Coastal Grotto. This place, okay, spyglass in the caption. So we're, where are we right now? We're here. There's a water source there. It looks like some wolves. And the other one's in the corner of the island, too. And there's another source here, too. There's an X marks spot. I wonder if that's where we've... Spyglass. I don't know. All right. We have a bunch of stuff. We can sleep. Uh, we can also make ourselves some food. Doesn't seem to be priority number one. So let's get some uh, quality of sleep. Yeah, we're going to make some food. Yeah, we're going to do that. Okay, so we'll add fuel. And then we need to start a fire. So, yes. Yeah, so minus 18 minutes if we're using that. Wow. Minus... That that little gum stuff, that's wicked good. That's where you wish you had the fire star, right? What does it say? Select fire star first. Oh! Die. I think as if I grabbed the fire star, I have to actually make one. Where are you? Should be here somewhere. Do I have to grab other items for this to pop up? I don't see it. Oh, there it is. All right, that's that's definitely needed. So we'll craft that up. Take small sticks. It says we have two of them. All right, five. All right. So let's start this up. We'll maybe put the gum stuff plus a fire starter with thirty-three minutes, and we can actually start the fire. There's a chance of not making it too. So, okay. So we have roasted crab. 20 minutes. I uh, can also make ourselves process scorpion venom. A scorpion carcass. A leaf bandage seems quite important to have. How much time does that take? 20 minutes. How much time left on a fire? Why don't I see you? 20 minutes. Alright, we'll just do this. Craft one of those. Alright, we're good. 
I won't overdo it either. So I have nothing else to eat and stuff. We can make ourselves some charcoal too. Can I craft enough fuel to finish it? Might as well just make it happen, right? I don't know. You know what? We're, we're probably getting ahead of ourselves. Uh, do I get to grab this? Oh, nice. The Santiago ship. I mean, he's destined to complete the map of the charcoal. Okay, local seas. A handy place here. Santiago sank. Not far from the island. Perhaps there. There's still something useful. Interesting. All right. Let's, uh, let's eat up. The fire just went out. We're in pretty good shape, I think. We could do a little better. Oh, it's dark. Oh, there's a chance of injury. That was stupid, because it's so dark. You need to do that in daylight and stuff. That is dangerous as frig. All right, I, I was lucky, I think, on that one. Please don't make me sick. Definitely healed me up, too, which is really nice. What does it give me right now? Too dark yet to do anything super dangerous. Sunburn, near death. It seemed like my health went up. Very interesting. All right, so let's uh, six hours or seven. And of course, because I don't have full, if I had full of this stuff, I think my health would have gone up too. One thing I want to do is make sure of this. So let's sleep for seven hours at least. All right, new goal, stone axe. We need to go and find that out. I guess we're going to come back here anyway, so we can drop off. I think this thing stays, if not mistaken, okay? I would like to make sure I re reduce some any issues I'm going to have. Maybe I should grab five of these. One, two, three, four, five. Let's craft up one of those. Leave cape. And... One of these. And we're going to need to still get more of those. Okay, for the shoes. Uh, we can make ourselves a belt too. We can expand our belt. We can carry stuff in. Celia's note. There we go. All the stuff we just found. Cool. All right, let's go and check this out. Why is he saying C4? Here. Oh, nice. Minus 25 chances. Perfect. We'll get some sun outside here. We can still see. And we'll craft this up. Taking quite a bit of time just to do that, right? But it's going to help out for water. And this one's going to help out for food, too. So. I keep that one on there. I want to tie and top myself off a little bit here. Just so we can start up this day pretty good. Alright, nice and full. Uh, we'll pick up some more coconuts on our way back. We'll drop some of these off here. I know it's dark, I'm sorry, but uh, not much of a choice, really. I got 13 of those dry ones. I'm going to want to craft. Oh, I have rocks already. What am I saying? What is it saying? Yeah, harvest stone. We can craft that up. Can't we do that? I remember that being something. Yeah, right here. That's what I was talking about. Cool. Okay, cool. We already got that. Craft a stone axe. Or how do you do that? Improve stone axe. Oh, that needs rope from the lian tree, I think it is. Lion tree. That's in the jungle. That just can be used for tools, efficiency, cools. Craft that up. Takes one stick. Ooh. Nice. Uh, harvest long sticks. All right. Uh, we have one and two right here. And that's where the belt, I think, comes in handy for this stuff. We'll worry about that afterwards. Now we have open here. It's a campfire we have that we just made. What we got for free. Stone blade axe. Okay, so something else to look for. Drop these off. Actually, you know what? Drop them off next to the fire. If I can. Because they are food. I put the fire start too. It's all about weight. You can go as far down. But I'm sticking this opens up as far as I wanted to. 
And yeah, we'll put sticks here too. And this fire starter thing there. And we'll just keep a very small amount of stuff. I might keep the, uh, well, we'll probably find some more stone, right? What I'm going to need is a knife, though. Is that considered my knife over there good enough? Yeah, it's a stone knife. I mean, an iron knife, not a stone knife, so don't have to worry about that. All right, I'll keep everything here. Okay, oh, they want us to go through there. I'm going to, oh, crap, I need to make a torch. It's dangerous to go through here. I, I can't see. And I know for a fact there's scorpions around there. So let's make this happen. How much does it take to make that torch? Oh, I can actually search here now. Cool. There it is. Okay. And can I just ignite that? I don't know, I want to drop it. Probably need my fire star for that, right? Ignites middle bus button. Okay. Very cool. I don't know. I guess I'll keep this. How much does this weigh? One pound? Okay. Uh, it's better than nothing. Just be careful. I know it's an easier way out. I should probably just leave the sticks here, but it's okay. Oh, it does go in my belt. Awesome. No, it's not going to work. Can I throw this anymore? That's weird. Throwing mode against this cancel. Oh, okay. I had to left click at this one is. I got it the first time without thinking about that, but okay. Just gonna leave those guys behind. <sighs> What's going on there? Natural recovery. Oh, look at that. Because we energy increases, all this wonderful stuff goes up because uh, we're full of that's nice. Oh, more guys. Uh, I was hoping for a two for one on that one. Probably not good for my knife at all. He threw it on like that. Oh shit, I didn't see him. Oh, did I get poisoned? Oh, I didn't see him. I was totally looking at bottom right to see if I could see the quality oh, the health of my sword. There is a fudge ton of these things around here. We come back through here again. We'll pick up all the sticks on our way back. I guess that's it. All right. Uh, can I turn that off? Extinguish. Extinguish. Uh, da -da. Yep. Perfect. All right. We'll put our axe back in here. They'll be our primary for now. Right, we do have some protection, so the sun shouldn't be as bad on us, right? So, where's my character with all the stuff? Here we go. We just need something for our feet to help us out. We need, they want us to go over there. There used to be boulders and stuff in here, right? Big guys, oh, a big rock right there. Yeah, it's chickens too. Hard to catch. They want us to go with these ones here. Okay. And we'll take all, yeah, because we need those. Five blueprints. Oh, nice. Uh, we got a wooden spear. I want that right away. Harpoon. That's for the fishing the water. I can never figure that out yet. Oh, this is the one I want. This one will actually help us sleep a lot better. A box. Okay. What's the one we can carry there? A portable box. That's 10 units. Uh, to carrying a weight. I kind of, I really want that big time. Ooh. But we're going to need a spear sooner or later. Now, how much weight are we carrying right now? 14 pounds. I should be able to 
grab ourselves a few more of those. Oh, I want to check out something. Uh, what? All resources extracted. Resources will be restored after a while. This requires a few weeks. I don't know exactly when, right? Craft a wooden spear. They want me to do it anyways. Okay. A little hand holding beginning just for us to kind of learn. And then they want us to go after the crabs, which are down below here. Oh, there's a pile of rocks right here. Uh, you know what? I'll take them. Okay, that got really dark really quick. <laughs> He's like jumping. It's awesome. Uh, okay, so if we open this up here, we'll be able to just bring this back over there. And that way I don't use my knife. Oops. What the hell did I just press? Okay, I had to actually leave the game, come back, save and exit. I couldn't figure it out what the heck I clicked on. Alright. Visibility is not very good. We can crouch here. Good job. Good job. Excellent. Slow down, crabs. Let's go back through the grotto over there and get some sticks for fire. There we go. Shut it! Freaky little friggin' dog. A little poodle. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna go back up top. Obviously, visibility is not great. Not a good time to craft. Oh, you little shite. Just leave it alone. I'm not sure where he's at right now. It's kind of dark as heck here. I was wondering if those rocks... I didn't even have a chance to check to see if those rocks replenish themselves somehow. And I, I usually... I don't think that is a thing, so... But there was a big boulder right there, so I think I'm going to grab that. I'm just going to double-check it to see if it does come back. Restores in 23 days. Interesting. Okay. I wonder if they said the same thing for the other ones. I didn't see that little thing I was reading on the left-hand side. We should have gotten more leaves, actually. But I have a chance of hurting myself doing that. Alright, we'll go through here. Now I find my secret opening. Uh, let's swap this out. And we're going to bring back our... Torch here. We're going to ignite it. Wind penalty. Crap, I just wanna. I don't know where the hell my exit where I jumped out from. Was that on top of one of these? On top of here? We jumped out, ran right for that area there. So no, it's gotta be around here somewhere. <sighs> I might have to take a long way around. It is super dark. Oh, man, yeah, I'm kind of lost here. My guy's getting tired, too, which is not great. All right, well, I guess we'll figure that out afterwards. That's kind of shitty. I can't see. It's a 30-minute shot each time. All right, let's get over it. I don't have time for this. Six years of doing this. If I harvest this now, do I have, uh, since I'm already here... I got no, uh, no issues. No need tools. Just gotta grab them. Oh, yeah. Sorry. Let's go check this. How many days is that? The store is in 34 days. Okay. See, I was looking at the left-hand side. I didn't see a little circle there. That's pretty cool. Crouching tiger hidden. Crap! Ah. That's right, dude. Who's going to be cooking up a feast tomorrow morning? If I can find sticks, that'll be something for sure. We're not super fatigued, though, so it's not so bad. Build a campfire. I already have one. I want to build another one. I don't think I have a choice, right? Go 
circle back around here. We're going to craft up a crappy one, though. Not the good one. It's just around that corner. Oh, I knows. I knows. Let's try and gather what we can from here. I would like to make that portable... portable chest there we can carry with us. I'm not sure how that works out or it just goes in our backpack, a bigger backpack. Is that what it is? This is just a backpack, isn't it? Let's go look at it. Back. Is this called backpack? No. Portable. Yeah, it is one. So we already have one. All right. So, I mean, it's not useful for me because I already have what I need. I thought it was something else we can put on us, but where you have a backpack, you can't have two, so... I'm happy that things are not here. What time is it anyways? We don't even know, do we? Should I do this and start food so I can sleep well? Yeah, I think so. Let's put two of them in here. Oh, wow. Lit right on the first shot. Beautiful. Okay. So let's cook this up. I can do multiples here. Beautiful. I would like to make a charcoal. Why not, right? All right, they want me to build a stupid campfire. Uh, first, we're gonna do is we're gonna eat. We're gonna we have some coconuts here. I think I need to harvest one in the daylight here. Which one of these give me more water? I think it's the fresh ones, eh? The green ones. Crafting. Okay, cool. Now we can maybe get ourselves some proper sleep. Yeah, like I just give you tons of water with that one. This one's just water. All right, we, we topped off pretty good. I think we ate like pigs. And the only thing I want me to do is craft. I think I'm going to try and just get over with. Press to view all the recipes. Oh. Oh my god, there's a bunch of them. Okay, wait. <laughs> That's interesting. Uh, campfire. Alright, we can do a cheap one. It's going to cost me five sticks, though. Oh god, it's daylight already? Alright, I had to sleep all day, dudes. Uh, just to catch up to the sleep, because we pushed them too hard. Place the resources, three of them. I know there's more up here. We killed all those little buggers off, so sorry for the darkness. I'm just trying to keep... some decent time. I don't know if they'll pop out. There you go. One. I just want to get it over with. So we can move on and see what else we need to do here. Okay, there's another one here. Strength is going up. Beautiful. Man, where the hell was this entrance? Oh, it's just up here. That's why I didn't see it. It's right on a little ledge here. What do these things give you? Oh, some more of this stuff. Okay. All right, let's build this campfire and place objects. There we go. Done. Built. Built. Oh. Find rope. Are you freaking kidding me? I don't know. It's like... What time of day is it? I think it's on the other side, too. Crap, I just came from here. I'll bring this... Drop this off for now. Oh, my primitive torch. I left it on, I guess. Oh, I'm such an idiot. Okay, I'll make a little garbage thing. What's this? Puffball mushrooms. Sound like they're important to eat, maybe? Mushrooms studied. What's that give you? Oh, we gotta put a food dehydrator. Okay. I'll make one of those soon. Crafting, we could make ourselves some stuff, but I think it's nighttime. I just want to see 
I'd like to get the shoes done. Okay, that's pretty good. Now we're fully loaded. I would like the belt too. I know I'm asking for a lot. <laughs> oh, I need rope for that. Okay. <sighs> what? Why is he going wolf for? He's like fully statted. Everything's good, dude. You're not gonna get some cave lung or some weird stuff, are you? I hope not. All right, we'll put this down here. I think I need more wild leaves for. We're gonna craft up the belt. Right? How much we need belt? I need one and one. I think. Not positive though. So I might just drop off, keep this stuff, and just drop off the regular stones and stuff. We might not need that right away. Okay, because weight issues are issues here. That's got a little bit of that. Maybe come back some more goodies. Yeah, I think we're good. Uh, it's, yeah, it's telling me to go back through the cave here. I mean, the torch is great, but it's a pain to put together. It's going to take us another 30 minutes or so. Oh, wow. Oh, crap. Where the hell? They come back. Well, I'm happy to see we're not getting a sun damage. With all the stuff we put on us, that's really good. Yeah, you kind of filled me up really nicely, dude. Now, there is some predators and stuff in this game, so be careful. Once we get to the jungles and other areas, there's also these crazy birds that... Oh. Alright, so let's see, cut down. Stone axe. It's gonna take up, wow, 15 of that for three sticks. Let's see if we can find any on the beach first. A bucket, I guess? I only got three sticks from that. Okay. Find the cartographer tree. There it is, right there. Oh, yeah, he probably would have asked me to do some charcoal. I made it in advance. So, yeah, sorry. I'll ask you to make it one way or another, but at least, you know what? Not like other games where you've actually crafted it, and then you have to do it again, which I'm super happy to see the devs working on that properly. Uh, they're awesome. Great little indie dev here. Love seeing already. A lot of passion. Very nice looking game. A lot of fun with this one. All right. God, I hate this tree. All right. Here's a cartographer tree. It's just from the beach. So we're going to hit this baby up here. I've fallen from the tree before. So, yeah, press E, and you can make yourself this ladder with that rope we got. Oh. I really don't like this ladder. Step up and climb. Oh. We did it. Oh, yeah, there's that bird friggin' nest there. Oh. Why don't I feel right about this? All right, so draw. Resource map. Okay, draw J. Eat a map. Great place for a map. Yeah, let's just check this out. And mapping. Start. Take three hours. Holy moly. And actually find yourself too. Start mapping the island. Start mapping. We got a lot of here already done, right? Did I do it already? Oh. Tutorial complete. On your own. Look at this now. We've got a whole bunch of stuff here. I'm going to check out this bird's nest. Oh, I'm so stupid. Oh, my God. They have worms. A couple of eggs. I should select all and see what. One hour and 40 minutes. We, don't, we need a tool for that. We need a tool to get this? Really? No uh, no tool needed. Okay, no. Frick, I thought it was a tool needed. Okay, harvest that up. That should have opened up a whole bunch of stuff. I pissed off a bird, though. Those things are nasty as shite. We're going to look at it in a second. Oh, my God. What is it doing that for? Okay. Automatically goes to the... Oh, it really drags you to the... Oh, man, that's so much better. Thank you, Dev. Fixing that up. All right. Reach it. Oh, shut it. I swear to God, dude. Come here, and I'm going to kill you. All right, we got the cartographer tree. And again, these are all the antibiotics and stuff we can pick up as we go through this. 
Uh, each one of these, of course, will take time for us to pick up if you want to pick up more. Uh, 34 minutes to do a full seven of those chamomile flowers. We'll look at that afterwards. If I'm mistaken, it's good for like when you're sick and stuff. You can utilize that. This can take 30 days to get back. This one's another 30 days. I think there's one more here with long sticks, right? Yeah, select all. Uh, chance of entry 21 because it's so dark. All right. We're not going with that. We're going to try and find our way back home. I think we're doing good on food. <sighs> Athleticism's gone up. We have to check that out. Oh, it's somewhere through here. Oh, there it is. That's why it's this little area here on top, the rock. Oh, that's how come I missed it. Now that stupid thing, thing is still in here. Friggin' thing. Just hop it around here. I'm trying to see if I can see him, but geez, it's so dark. All right, so I'll have to take a little jump. Jump! jump. I don't know if that worked or not. I didn't see him. Okay. That we go. Oh, man. We brought back some pretty good stuff at the grotto, though. And we're doing pretty darn good. Really nicely good. All right. We're going to get some sleep for the night. We'll get ourselves back in action tomorrow morning. Uh, but yeah, we're going to leave the episode here. Thanks for being here. Thanks for being part of this. We have so much left for us to do. The map is quite huge. Uh, we have the character stuff here, too. Oh, the guy reduces uh, crafting duration. It's already up. We got fire starting is up too. Hmm. A little more cooking needed. And what's with cooking? Gonna give me increases food nutrition. Nice. Aiming speed with throwing. Nice. That's good too. Reduces stamina drain. And max carrying weight. Oh, cool. Plus 5%. We started off on 40, I think it was, right? 46, or I think it was 44. Yeah, pretty cool. All right, so we'll work on this afterwards. Uh, we'll check out, wait, before we go. Before we go, before we go. Fried eggs. Ooh, we're going to make that tomorrow morning. Freaking A, love eggs. And stone arrows. Still need more oh. rope. Got to go over to the jungle, I think, to find the yeah, ropes. And we're going to need to find those ropes over there. Yeah, no choice. And gathering too. Reduces gathering, mining, and duration. Oh, I like this. All right, cool. Anyways, thanks for being here. Thanks for being part of this. Again, enjoying this hit like button, all that wonderful stuff. You guys are the best. This game edge. I'm going to catch you guys on the flip side. Mm -hmm.